This video presents the main physics concepts behind the operation of the microphotonic cell sensor chip. It is the result of a collaborative research project between Polytechnique Montreal and the Research Center at Maison of Rosemont Hospital in Canada. The bottom pattern plate we see here is made of a sandwich of silicon crystals with a very thin layer of glass in between, giving this blue color. To give an idea of the scale, the small bars on each side of the channel are one micron thick, that is about one hundredth the size of a human hair. Deeper structures showing the glass are microfluidic channels. They are used for 3D hydrodynamic focusing. Indeed, the small scale at which fluids are manipulated leads to a rather weird behavior. They do not mix. That effect allows a liquid to be focused at the center of the channel while being surrounded also by liquids. With this configuration, cells can be transported quickly and positioned precisely. Sealing the chip with a Pyrex plate and adding tubing completes the microfluidic operation. Perpendicular structures are microphotonics components used to manipulate light. Light is injected through common optical fibers directly in the integrated waveguides. The small bars introduced earlier are actually mirrors. Light bounces in between them, creating a resonant optical microcavity. This cavity represents the arc of the sensor. It measures the refractive index in its vicinity. So when cells pass through, the refractive index is measured. For a biological cell, the simplest model is a nucleus, which contains DNA, encapsulated in a membrane. In a very small channel, forces can drive the cell to be deformed. This mechanical deformation and the refractive index are both specific properties of a cell. When measured with this device, they give precious information that no other machine can. It helps health professionals conduct their diagnostics and deepens our understanding of the human body.